Hey gang, Tony here. Who's ready for another poorly lighted YouTube extravaganza? Oh, that's right, you are. I have a couple of boxes that came in today. So I'm gonna do two videos. And they are both trade boxes. So, I will crack into the first one, the one that's nearest me. And this is, ah, from Jared Guy. All right, so Jared recently, I've been doing a lot of trade boxes lately because I got pretty fair amount of doubles of Nintendo games and Game, GameCube games and uh, other retro video game stuff. Not that GameCube's retro, but that's another story. Anyway, um, and I had a few people contact me and said they said they were interested in doing a trade, and uh, Jared Guy was one of them. So I sent along what he wanted with a couple little extras, and he sent along what I wanted, and now we're going to find out what it is. We have a no spoilers letter, so I'm going <laughs> to... Well, no spoilers till you get to the PS part, so I'll make sure not to get to the PS part. No, 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 no. I'll just fold it up there. Okay, Anthony, I hope everything is going good. Here are some... <clears throat> here are some of the items we traded for and some extras just because you rock. I saw on Facebook you're going to be getting some of your books and CDs uh, in. I would love to be... I would love a signed copy. Uh, that would be so cool. Anyway, hope you will like... Uh, hope you like this stuff. Alright, great. Thank you, uh, Jared. Yeah, I'm, I ordered... I think five copies of my novel, Soundtrack to the End of the World, which is a uh, paperback. And uh, I ordered them so that I could sign them and then put them into my store envy site because recently I've noticed a few people looking for the book. And it's not really, I, it's still available, but it's kind of like not the easiest book to find in the world because my publisher, for one reason or another, doesn't like really have it in the places that you would expect it to be. So I decided just to buy a few and I'll let you guys know when those are available. So let's take a look at what we got here in the Jared Guy trade box. On top, oh wow, that's awesome. This is the uh, Kid Robot Stick of Truth Cartman figure. This was a, um, now, I'm almost positive that this was a an exclusive item. Maybe it wasn't exclusive, but uh, it's for the video game, the Stick of Truth. And I know for a fact I almost was gonna buy this actually. Uh, and I can't remember if it was like a Kickstarter or if it was just like the special edition of the game. It was probably the special edition of the game came with this, right? Uh, but it is so cool. It is. Let me see. No, there's no way. I'm not gonna open this. I was just checking to see if it was like one of those, like a Funko Bop, a uh, Funko Pop box, a Funko Bop, uh, but uh, it is not, so he is staying in there, the Grand Wizard. Actually, it says collect them all, so maybe this wasn't with the game at all, maybe it was just a, a separate thing that they did. I can't remember. Very cool. This is awesome. I actually was going to get this, so that's a really, really too cool. Thank you. Um, Let's see, next up, uh oh. So th this was closed at one point, but it popped open. And inside is, what is this? What is this? It's, are those those like, um, what do they call it? Are they called like hex bugs or something? It looks like a, uh, I mean, it's, a, it's definitely a mechanical bug of some kind. I think they're called hex bugs, unless, unless it's something like that. I don't know. I don't know how to make it work. I didn't know. And I'm not gonna sit here and try to figure it out while you all stand. Well, eh. Eh. I'll figure it out. But you do something and it moves, I imagine. <laughs> Bugs. I have a, I have a mother spider in my mailbox with, um, whatchamacallit, with uh, a little, egg sack and she's protecting it and I I protect her she's in the mailbox I'm you know I'm hoping that she's okay in there but I don't kill her I'm letting her hatch her eggs and then we're gonna have many baby it'll be like Charlotte's Web <laughs> all right so the first game that he sent in the trade is the Super Mario Kart Super Nintendo uh, 
game. I actually, I have a copy of this, but my the, the copy I have, the label, is just like torn up and it's all in awful condition. So uh, I said okay to this game because it's a label upgrade and um, I really wanted like a good copy of it for my collection. So that's very cool. I'm gonna be playing many hours of Mario Super Mario Kart. Love that game. Thank you for putting it in bags, by the way. I, uh, I think I put mine in like shopping bags or something when I sent it to you. And we have, all right, Do Donkey Kong Country. Again, a uh, Super Nintendo game, Donkey Kong Country. This is another one that I had been looking for uh, and really meaning to buy one way or the other. Kind of half hoping that it would end up in a uh, yard sale. So I'm glad that I got it in the trade. Very cool. I forgot what I sent you, Jared. I know there were like a bunch of games. I don't remember what games they were though. Oh, Pokemon, Pokemon Snap, Pokemon, Pokemon, Pokemon Stadium. Um, I forget the other games. Let's see. Woo. Oh man, you sent the um. Did I forget if this was part of the part of the trade or not? But you sent the uh, the Super Game Boy. That's awesome. Thank you. So we got the Super Game Boy. That's so you could play Game Boy games on the Super Nintendo. Very cool. I have to give that a try. See how that looks. I do have a whole bunch of uh, Game Boy games from a, a previous trade with Mr. Tony of the Dead. And... Ah, Star Fox, right. We have the Super Nintendo Star Fox game. Sweet. This one has some uh, writing and stickers and stuff on it, but it just so happens that I'm pretty good at cleaning up carts, so no worries on that front. I can get this thing spick and span. Except for a little tear on the label, but that's okay. Star Fox. I don't think I ever played this one. It's one of those games that I always wanted to play and just never have. Awesome, man. I think there was... Yeah, there's something else in here. There's a couple of something else's. Holy crap. It's Jessica Rabbit. It's a Jessica Rabbit pop. I didn't know that these existed. Final figure. Ah, oh, this is awesome. That's too cool. Yeah, they have Roger Rabbit pops. Holy crap. Look at that. That's awesome. Thank you, man. I think you, you went above and beyond. I, I sent you a couple extra items, but I don't know if they... There's more in here. I don't know if they live up to this. Uh, oh, cool. Hard candy. I feel like someone... Was it you, Jared? Someone was telling me I have to see this movie. I don't remember if it was you or not. Was it this movie or was it Jawbreaker? That's probably... It must have been Hard Candy. <laughs> it's, like, it's the same thing, right? Hard Candy, Jawbreaker, that's why I mix them up, I guess. But uh, I'm pretty sure someone was telling me to see this. Maybe it was you. So thank you. This is awesome. I've never actually seen this movie. It's brand new. Thanks. I'll do a little... Um, I haven't been doing my weekly movie roundup thing, so I have to, uh, I have to get back on that. Oh, what is this? That's so cool. Um... I think it's a magnet. Maybe not a magnet. Let me see. Well, it was an easy way to find out. It's a magnet. Okay. Um, kick punch. It's got... It looks like... Um, I know it's a video game thing because it has the triangle and the circle from PlayStation on the PlayStation controller. And it says kick punch. Uh, I've, at first, I thought it was a frogger thing because it's a little frog. But there's this microphone here. Um, not entirely sure what game that's referring to because PlayStation era was kind of when I wasn't playing too many video games. But that's awesome. Thank you so much. This is going here. Perfect. Uh, awesome trade, Jared. As always, you uh, went above and beyond and make sure. Oh, and there was that uh, PS that you have here. Would you do a review on the movie, please? And thank you, CCAA, for life and death. <laughs> With the candy corn there. Uh, yeah, absolutely. I will do the uh, hard candy review. I actually have to do the review for Demon Queen and also from Demons that Johnny sent me. So I'll, uh, I'll get these movies viewed and reviewed very soon. 
Again, thanks so much, Jared. Awesome trade. I hope you like the games. They should be on their way uh, to you very soon. Uh, well, I sent it out already. It'll be there. It'll be there soon. Uh, again, thanks so much, everybody. Have a good one. I'm coming back with one more unboxing from a trade with uh, Mr. Tony of the Dead. So I'll see you in a second. Breathe deep of the night.